Welcome back to Eagle Landing here at Oak Leaf Plantation. Now we're tuning up your golf game with Tim Spangler. In this segment, let's get you in the right position when we're talking about the takeaway. Welcome back everybody. In the first tip we talked about your basic fundamentals, grip, stance, posture. Now we're going to get into the backswing, what to do, how to properly load it, get you set up for that through swing, which we're going to cover a little bit later. So getting your grip, stance, posture, how we talked about earlier. Now one key thing to help you get into your proper stance is going to be how far you are from the golf ball. Now you can see, if I get a long way from the golf ball, see how it affects my posture. I can't get into the proper posture, nor you know, nobody would ever get into the, pro the improper posture this way because it's just not normal, it's not natural. But we will get too far away. So, general rule of thumb, when you're setting up to, this, to your golf shot with whichever club you're using, about a fist between the butt of the club and your body. Now, some people may have a fist and a half, that's fine. Just don't get too crazy where you find yourself with three fists, four fists in here because then all of a sudden it's just going to affect everything you do in the golf swing. So. Helping you get into your posture, one fist, you can see now we're standing tall, slight knee bend. Now, when we take the club back, first thing we want to do is try to keep our center. We want to try to keep our spine angle. You have to pretend like when you're playing golf, your spine angle stays right there and we're just going to rotate around it. So the better you can keep this position throughout your whole swing, the better you're going to hit the golf ball. You don't want to get into all this movement because then it's going to be harder for you to bring the club back down to the ball and even harder for you because you may only play once a week, you may play once a month. So if you have struggles to get that down, the more simple and stable you can keep that, the better you're going to shoot when you've taken a lot of time off. So again, spine angle, keeping that spine angle where it's at. So as we get set up here, got my spine angle. Now I'm going to try to maintain this as I take the club back. So as I take the club back, in order to maintain my spine angle, think about it from your chin's perspective. If you keep your chin right where it starts, you'll be able to keep that spine angle because your chin, when you move it, will move your spine angle. So again, think about it in long term of your chin. So keep your chin where it's at. Now as we take the club back, you can see I'm going to go into what I call a handshake position. It's basically if you're standing here, somebody's standing behind you, you're going to shake their hand. Notice I don't have my hand down, I don't have it up. Just a handshake position. So that's my first position in the golf swing. Keep my chin, handshake position. Now, to get that handshake position, I tried to keep my left arm as straight as I could. Now, the next thing that happens from this handshake position is the shoulder rotation and the load. Now, everybody loads when they do something athletic. Again, whether you throw a ball, whether you swing a golf club, anything you do playing tennis, you're going to load it to the right side so you can unload it to the left. No different in the golf swing, yet so many times we see loading here and then we're going to go back to here. That's going to create those golfers that top it or slice it. You may be one of them. So when we think about loading, a good thing you can do in front of a mirror, get your stance, get your posture, look right into the mirror again, try to keep your chin and then you want to load. You can see how I've loaded everything onto my right side so that I can create as much power as I can to unload it to the left. Again, it's a load and an unload in the golf swing. So, as we get set up here, get our good posture, we're going to take the handshake position. Now, keeping our posture, we're going to load back to our right, and this is going to be your golf swing taking it back. Now, as we talk about, we've talked about it before, about outside, inside, we're not really talking about that right now. You just set the club. Again, try to take it back as straight as you can, and you're going to get set, handshake position, and then turn the shoulders and load it. And you'll see that your shoulder will get just about even with the ball. Now, your shoulder may not go that far, but that's fine. Take as much of a backswing as your flexibility will allow you. But that's going to be the basic start. And one little drill I want you to leave with when you're practicing that load. Get yourself set up, and as you go back to the top, take your left foot back to your right, and you can see you load on the right, and then you can unload it all on the left. That will be a great way for you to feel that load sensation, and then you can unload it back. When we come back, we're going to talk about the release and the finish of the golf swing so we can complete your whole makeover. All right, another great tip there by Tim Spangler. I tell you what, from setup to getting this in the correct position, back getting loaded, next segment we're going to work on is finishing it up, and that will tune up your golf swing when you come out here and play this beautiful golf course. Again, 
Conditions are perfect out here at Eagle Landing. All the information that you need is on their website, eaglelandingonline.com. We'll have more when we come back from the commercial break. PGA Tour Stop at the World Golf Village. Florida's largest golf store is also Florida's top destination for custom fit golf clubs. Only the Tour Stop can offer custom fitting systems from every major manufacturer, measured and confirmed outside on the Slimer and Squire driving range. And our club trade-in program and low price guarantee assures you of receiving the best possible price. Guaranteed. PGA Tour Stop at the World Golf Village, the ultimate golf store. 